I'm going to do, deal with the next two um, features together because they're both uh, often used in combination. It's the cutoff filter and the resonance filter. The cutoff filter takes a range of frequencies in the sound from high at this end to low at this end. Sorry, the way you're looking at it, it'll probably be high this end and low this end. Okay, and it will take away the high frequencies the more you um, bring the cutoff down. So uh, another word for cutoff filter is a low pass filter because it only allows the low frequencies to go past. Um, the high frequencies get cut off. So as I play a note, I'm going to increase the cutoff filter and you can hear the difference in the note. <laughs> side of the sound, the high frequencies have all gone. If I bring the cutoff filter back up, you'll hear the high frequencies coming back in. And back off again. The resonance filter will boost the highest one of those frequencies that's left by the cutoff. So it makes the sound more ringy when you've got high notes. So we put the cutoff filter very high up. So there's lots of high frequencies, and then we boost the resonance, you'll hear a ringiness in the high end of the sound. Okay, now if I bring the cutoff filter down now, you'll hear the resonance boosts a lower and lower frequency as it goes down. I'll turn it down a bit because it'll be very loud. So that's boosting the highest frequency that's left by the cutoff. So when there's only low frequencies left by the cutoff, it will boost those instead. Okay, so the resonance filter boosts high frequencies, the cutoff filter removes high frequencies.